Okay, so previously Roblox had updated and that basically caused FPS Unlocker to stop working. Today, however, the developer of FPS Unlocker created a new update that fixed this. Today, I will be showing you guys how to install the new version of FPS Unlocker July 2021. The first thing you want to do is delete the old version. So you're going to go into your uh, your little control panel here. Because it's not an application, you can just go ahead and delete it here. I'll just take this and delete and it's gone. The next thing you're going to do is go to this website, which is going to be linked down below in the description. This is basically the creator of FPS Unlocker saying that his house got struck by lightning literally this afternoon. And uh, <laughs> he's been working on FPS Unlocker and he just made a new version of it which is just amazing. After you go to this website, press this download here button 64 bit. This will open up in WinRAR or compressed Windows file. The next thing you want to do is find your file. I put my files to download on my desktop so it's right there. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to click the file. I'm going to click extract here. Once I press extract here, FPS Unlocker is going to show up right over there. Okay, so we're going to test out FPS Unlocker and the new updates that the developer has added to the application, which as listed here is like custom support for FPS caps, fixed the July 28th, 2021 Roblox update, added 165 and 360 to the list for default cap options. And yeah, let's go ahead and uh, test this out right now. So I'm gonna open up Arsenal. Arsenal is opening up. Alrighty guys, the first thing I'm gonna do is press Shift plus F5. Shift plus F5 will open some kind of log on the top left corner of your screen and you'll be able to see that right now my FPS is 60. It's not getting any higher and it's barely going any lower. Now what I'm gonna do next is I'm going to open FPS Unlocker. So I'm gonna click on the application. This will pop up like usual and it's gonna minimize to my tray. And right now, as you guys can see, my FPS is currently over 200, which is pretty exquisite and pretty good. And now, yeah, my FPS is over 200. And I'm going to go to FPS Unlocker just to check out the new updates, see what he added. So what I see here is that he's added an FPS cap for 165 and 360, just to cap your FPS at 165, which will do this to my FPS. So if I press this, this will happen. Basically, my FPS cannot go over 165 which I think is pretty cool. Then he added another cap, which is at 360, but unfortunately, I don't think I'm even able to reach 360 right now, as I'm currently recording, and I have multiple applications open right now. But if not, this is a brilliant update, and I'm so grateful for this developer, guys. Make sure you guys do give him a big thumbs up, and support him in whichever way you can. And uh, yeah, that is a tutorial, and now you can enjoy your very, very sweet gameplay as you destroy people at arsenal if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to do leave a like down below let me know what fps you had at the end of the day after doing this tutorial and if you're new here make sure you guys do subscribe to the channel i would really appreciate that thank you guys all so much and i will see you all in the next one take care